Okay, so breakfast today, I'm just having a small bowl of Cheerios with skim milk and a banana. And I'm gonna have a hard boiled egg, give me some protein, and a coffee with skim milk. So all of this is simply filling. Um, this is about a cup of Cheerios, which I think is a three points. I'm not sure, I'll have it on the screen for you. Okay, so for lunch today, all I can say is thank you meal prep, because if I didn't have this already prepped, I probably, I don't know what I've done, because I'm still not feeling all that great today. So I'm having another one of the bean, meat, and cheese burritos. If I felt better, I would put some lettuce and stuff on it, but I just don't feel like it. And um, I was going to pack some sour cream, but I didn't even need it yesterday. So I think I'm just going to stay like this. And then I'm going to bring one of the toasted marshmallow yogurts. I have some carrots and peppers. These ones are the ones I had from yesterday that I didn't eat. Same with the pineapple. I had this yesterday that I didn't eat. So this is lunch today and it's all 100% simply filling. For snacks, I'm going to bring this is the same popcorn and the same applesauce from yesterday. And then I did eat my tomatoes yesterday, so these are new tomatoes and an apple. So snacks is also 100% simply filling. Good morning, friends. So what is today? Thursday? Happy Thursday. I'm feeling... I don't know. <laughs> um, I don't have any stomach pains or cramps or anything so so far today, so that part's good. Um, I my hip is really sore, but I can walk today. Um, it gets so out of alignment that it you can actually physically see one higher than the other, which I think most of the time I'm like that anyway. But when it gets so bad that um that it's painful to walk and i did a bunch of stretches last night and um when i went to bed about nine i just couldn't sleep i mean i fell asleep um earlier than i have in a while but it was so much pain every, every time i'd move or try to roll over or just move <laughs> in general um it was just like a shooting pain so um yeah so i didn't get much sleep but when i got up this morning i was able to walk and it's really really painful i think it's just from um it's still out of alignment but it's not as bad as it was yesterday so i think it's just painful from the way i was having to walk and adjust yesterday because my lower back and upper back is really sore and i think it's just because the position i was in um, it's hurting really bad to stand up, so I will have to sit down probably all day at work. I got a ridiculous low amount of steps yesterday, so I'm sorry to my team at work. Oh, yeah, my because I get I usually turn in quite a few steps for the week, but I just couldn't do it yesterday. And today it'll probably be about the same. I think I only got four thousand yesterday. Um, but I want to rest up, you know, for the weekend and. I am going to take the rest of the week off of any working out and I'll just see how I feel next week. I think I'm going to have to be careful because I'm sure it was the workout that did this. Um, I was thinking about the exercises that I did on Tuesday before, no, what is, yeah, Tuesday and I'm pretty sure that's probably what did it. Um, you know, I did things like the step ups and the chair I step up onto is like 14 inches and then there's a lot of speed like squats in and out squats jumping jacks i mean it could have been any of that stuff that did it and i don't know it's sometimes i don't have to do anything sometimes i can be bending over cleaning the bathtub and i go to stand up and i stand up just wrong or something and it just pops it out of alignment so i don't have to do much but I know I, I have to listen to my body and it's really, really painful right now. So I just need to stay off of it. And I'm really upset about that. Um, today would have been the fit test. Today would have been 60 days on Bikini Body Mommy. Um, so I, hopefully I can pick up next week. But I am kind of bummed. I didn't measure this morning just because I haven't worked out all week. And so I don't know. I might take measurements this weekend or something just to see. But... Um, yeah, so I'm just, I'm kind of bummed about that because I really wanted to get the whole 90 days, 
but I don't want to hurt myself in the process. Um, last night I did eat a little bit of dinner. Um, I already was starting to export this video or yesterday's video um, because I decided not to eat. I just wasn't feeling it. wasn't feeling good. I was just going to have a yogurt, but I went ahead and made the chili, like I said, because I wanted it for leftovers today. Um, so I went ahead and made the chili, and um, I made my son a baked potato so he could have the chili over that. And so I thought, well, I'll just try it. So I took like a quarter of a baked potato and just one, like, I mean, probably only a quarter cup of the chili. I mean, I really, I just wanted to mainly try it, and my stomach was kind of gurgly, and I couldn't tell if it was gurgly because I was hungry or gurgly because I wasn't feeling well, um, but I didn't eat it all. I, I really only ate about half of it, but I just, I wasn't hungry, so I didn't eat the rest of the day. Um, so this morning I woke up pretty hungry, so I had, as you saw, I had a Cheerios, just on, I needed something simple because I cannot stand up for that long. It's hurting so bad to stand up. Um, thankfully, my job, I can sit down most of the time. I don't think I have a lot going on. So, um, yeah, so that's what I have for breakfast. And like I said, thank goodness for meal prep because then I didn't have to stand and do anything or try to figure out lunch today. So I had the that bean burrito left over. I have more in the freezer. I think I might take them out and the kids can have them for dinner time if they want part of the leftovers. And I'll make some more this weekend because they're really good. Um, so I had that and then I had all that stuff packed from yesterday that I didn't eat that I put in the refrigerator when I got home. So I'm just sorry I'm kind of a downer this week. Um, it's real life and when I'm not feeling good, but I just wanted to share with you guys and let you know how it's going. Um, I'm still enjoying Simply Filling. Um, and I'm gonna probably talk more about it in my video on Monday, my wrap up video of our two week collab. Um, but I'm, I know I already told you guys, I was pretty sure I was going to stick this out for the rest of the month. Um, but I mean, I'm hoping that those who have watched me for a long time, um, you know, for smart points will continue watching cause I'm going to do a lot of things besides just, you know, what I eat videos. You guys know I do, you know, quite a few videos and I feel like that my meals are still really smart point friendly and I'm hoping they still give you ideas and that um, you won't stop watching because I am doing Simply Filling. So just let me know your thoughts down below. I'm just really curious what you guys think and um, and also any other video ideas you guys have. You know, I mean, most of my ideas I've gotten from videos have been from you guys and you guys requesting them. So um, yeah, let me know down below if you guys have any requests, especially coming up. I, I have the last week of March off for spring break. So that's a good time for me to do new videos. So if you, I'm going to see if I can do maybe some Pinterest win or fail again, um, but I'm just going to try to film as much as I can that week in between getting my house together. I ordered, oh, I'm so excited, you guys. This is, I am the biggest, like, organized nerd, I swear, but I ordered some refrigerator organizers from Amazon. I'm just so, I don't know why I'm so excited because I just think they're so cute, but um, I got one for my husband's Cokes because I've told you guys before, he goes through like four 12 packs a week. Um, and I got one for, um, and I hate those containers in the refrigerator, so it's clear plastic. And then I got an egg plastic thing and a couple other ones, and I might order some more. I'm going to see how these fit in there. And then I ordered a mug tree because I showed you guys I want one. And this one has storage on top where you can put K-cups. So... Um, I don't have to put them all in the drawer, so my tea, and I feel like a lot of my tea is just crammed in there. So I can, I'll show you guys that. It's supposed to come today, so I'm excited. So I will show you guys that. Um, so I really want to get a lot of organizing done in my cupboards and stuff over spring break, but I do want to film a lot. So let me know down below any um, video requests that you might have, and I will do my best to do them. Um, depending on what they are. Remember, I just use a phone for filming, so a lot of it's kind of hard. I don't have a big tripod or anything, so a lot of things it may be hard for me to do, but just let me know what you guys would like to see, and I gotta get um, get moving, because I gotta go to work. I'm gonna pick up coffee at Dutch Brothers this morning, because um, I have a gift card, so 
I thought I figured I will use that. And I'm going to get an iced, um, what they call a kicker, which is just cough, but just espresso, um, milk and Irish cream. So I'll get non-fat milk and sugar-free Irish cream. So it'll be simply filling. So I will talk to you guys probably tomorrow, um, unless anything happens that I need to check in with you about after work. Tonight is leftover night, so I will show you what I end up having. It'll probably be the chili, but I'm not sure. We'll see how I'm feeling and what I feel like having, but I will be sure to show you. So I will talk to you guys in the morning. Bye guys.